AFC Championship game that we played against the Bears. Montana back to throw it. 197, three touchdown. To right. That's three away from 200. Caught by Jerry Rice. He gets the win. It's a foot race. They won't touch him. It's touchdown, 49er. Was there an, a moment, Joe, for you or an epiphany? Maybe it was at a practice. When you turn to Bill Walsh and go, this guy's unguardable. You can't cover him. Any discussion of all-time best NFL players. Oh, for Rice! Oh, oh, oh. Has to include Joe Montana and Jerry Rice. But the youngster is having a big night. Rice, eight receptions, 169 yards, as you can see. But look at that average. So what makes a great wide receiver? I never thought I had natural uh, talent. I never thought I was the most gifted when athlete. When Jerry Rice comes into the league, um, you know, Mississippi Valley State. As a senior, Rice scored 28 touchdowns. Well, the funny thing about Jerry is that he had deceptive speed. I mean, he wasn't probably the fastest guy in the NFL ever. But he got behind more guys than I've ever seen. just a flat-out sprint. They said when he came into the league that he wasn't that fast. Well, maybe not from a standing start, but most football plays start on the Career road. Career statistics, it it's not even close. Career receptions, yards, touchdowns, not even close. Weiss will score his 52nd touchdown. 68 yards. Montana. Rice. Or is it about doing the work on all the little things, the route running, yep. the footwork, the body control. All flags are down, touchdown! Montana gets it to Rice. But most people believe the greatest wide receiver in NFL history and perhaps the best player is Jerry Rice. And Jerry Rice was determined, was driven, was uh, habit-based. Breaking the tackle is Rice. He's going to go all the way. He, he's so deceptive, and I, I don't know how he did it year after year after year, but he could he could get behind almost anybody. Jerry Rice is still the best wide receiver that ever played in this game. Timeout, young throw. It is interesting, your personality, you are the perfect superstar. That you weren't showing. Touchdown, uh, 150th of his career. The thing I, that I... Uh, that I was going to do. I was going to outwork you. Montana having trouble. Rice. I mean, when you watched him in practice, you knew he was something special. What a catch! Holy cow, what a catch! Francisco 49ers going for their third Super Bowl win in this decade. He was one of those guys that he actually created a different work ethic on the team. Uh, the GOAT, as many people refer to. Can you consciously dial up your best when it matters most? Another thing that is really serious for you defensively, Montana has had all kinds of time to throw the football. I think Jerry Rice is clearly the greatest receiver of all time. He throws deep, Rice out of bounds at the 11-yard line. I don't think anyone can cover Jerry Rice man-to-man. -man. He got that one off just as he was kissed. As we're sitting here talking about him, I get chills of knowing how great he was. Still on his feet. Finally dragged down at the 46 yard line. Jerry Rice is one of those once in a lifetime spirits. Both wide receivers to the left, Taylor and Rice. The throw is to Rice. Magic about him. When I started coaching him in Oakland, we nicknamed him the GOAT, the greatest of all time. What a catch by Rice! Unbelievable again! Look at the totals, they're racking up. And it is good! Cincinnati leads again 16-13. During that last three minutes, 10 seconds, where we had to move the ball over 80 yards down the field, 
and win that football game. Two minutes to go. San Francisco needs three. Edwards, the veteran, from Miami of Florida. On first down, Montana. And that should put him right at the 200-yard mark today.